Yeah, I need to try to force myself to stay up all night. <clears throat> I gotta go back to work tomorrow. Gotta get my sleep schedule back on track. <clears throat> hey, Akela and Timu, thank you for the host. You are a gentleman and a scholar. No, but yeah, I bought some Bud Light, and then I've got the five steel reserves left over. That I thought about drinking last night, but I didn't. <clears throat> Ended up passing out early. Uh, Timu, do you know what the weakness is uh, against the Vile? Because I do want to try to do the... Do you want to try to get the Z-Saber? Since I've never done that before. Tigers and Crawfish both work. Okay. So I just have to use one. I don't have to use both. Oh, that was BS. For the killing blow, okay. And I guess just on the second form. Like, the suit doesn't matter, or his mech doesn't matter. <clears throat> okay, cool. Yeah, I'll definitely do that then. I mean, I'm sure I can make it to the Doppler stages. My big concern is, uh... My, my big concern is, um, Sigma. Sigma without the, uh, the upgrades. Because my strategy won't work. The strategy I use to beat the game won't work because I don't have the upgrades. Yeah, exactly. I'll see a different boss. Totally. That's that's part of the idea. But also to make the gameplay a little more interesting. A little more challenging. X uses it to create an energy wave. Okay, I didn't know that. Sounds interesting. Oh, if you have the buster upgrade. Okay, yeah, we're not going to get the buster upgrade. It's just a melee weapon. Okay. Oh, this will be fun without the air dash. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I forgot about this guy.
Okay, I see what you're supposed to do. Notice the uh, the explosions. X has some pretty long ones too. I mean, I guess if you're speed running and watching the explosions a thousand times, uh, yeah, it might get annoying, but I mean, casually, it's fine. But this is Timo, he's only speedrun. Head shine fist pump. <laughs> I like that. Alright, good. This guy can give me trouble. You know, I decided one thing I am going to do is adjust the crop. And I should probably create a new save file just in case something weird happens. <laughs> 17 seconds. Man, a whopping two seconds faster. What will we ever do?
Ah, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Just to fill up that space. <clears throat> A middle ground between the soundtracks? Yeah, I think there could be. Yeah, I mean, that's that's the big issue with this one, is it doesn't really have a rocking feel. Like, some of the tunes are obviously, you know, you know, relatively up-tempo, but... They're not rocking, per se. They're just fast. Doesn't have that, that rock and roll edge, you know? I mean, Mega Man X has always been more metal than rock. A little closer to the metal side of things. Which is, I think, where that edge really comes from. Is this guy's jumps completely random? Dude, I did it again. I ran into him earlier. I'm supposed to just you could just slide right under him. Cool, at least he gave me some health. It's a set pattern? Okay. It feels different to me. Like whether he he hops over you or doesn't seems to be com like to me it seems to be random. Yeah, I mean, I thought it might depend on your movement, but I haven't figured it out. Hey, regarding uh, bit and bite, <clears throat> um, are you supposed to kill them like with a weakness or something to unlock something else? Or am I just confusing that with the vile fight? Different Doppler 1 boss, huh? Hmm. I'm a little scared to try that since Doppler 1 is where the game crashes.
I would like to see that, though. I think I might just resort to looking up a long play. You don't have to, man. I'm it's it's online already. You don't need to waste your time. Unless you just want it there for your YouTube channel. I mean, that's cool too. But don't do it just for me cuz videos are already out online. You don't need to waste your time just to show me. <clears throat> That's right, so Vile only appears after this point. Oh, see, I hit select too early, and it skipped the save uh, functionality. Um, yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter where I go now. Derpy, 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 derp, derp. I'm thinking about trying to play Mega Man on Game Gear later tonight, since uh, people had mentioned it on the YouTube stream. Man, it's tough. But it's easy. You get unlimited continues. I, I see what you mean, okay. Hmm.
Gotcha. You know, I had no clue. Alright, whatever. <laughs> oh shit, I... Uh, I always forget about that. Yeah, I'm not gonna spend the next five hours trying to successfully do that. But I wanted to try it. Fuck. Is that game over? No. How many extra lives do I have? This is probably my last life. Yeah, zero. God damn it. <laughs> Noob mistakes. Yeah, right? Spike Man just would have made too much sense. <laughs> that always happens to me. I land on the door and it just forces me out. It's like no health pickup for you.
Hmm. Yeah. Well, I mean, that is sort of the case in some games, Timu. So, like, like in Mega Man 3, your normal buster shot will just do one hit point of damage, but if you use Needle Man, it'll oftentimes do two or more hits. So that in itself is kind of like a weakness, you know? It's not the perfect weakness, but if you have Needle Man's weapon, it's... You'll do more damage than your regular buster, so it's a form of a weakness. A lot of the classic Mega Mans are like that. I like it when I can get him into a loop like that. Blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna go get a refill, I'll be right back. <sighs> Had to go shut my blinds too. I had a couple of them open. It's getting kind of warm in here. Part of it could be because um, <clears throat> some of the um, cool air was getting out, getting out through my windows. So you said the tiger works, so I could technically defeat Vile right now. But truly... Yeah, uh, I understand that. Like, there's a lot of, uh, uh, forced sliding down ice. Like this right here. It makes for fast gameplay.
So I guess that's it. Sweet. What you doing, Patchouli? Down for the count. Oh, there's... That's right, there's slowdown in the Super Nintendo one. I forgot. Alright, Zemi, so I assume there's a way to get that without uh, the boots upgrade. That's gonna be a pain in the ass with those guys shooting at me. <laughs> Actually, I don't want that. No boots for you. <laughs> Lucky. <laughs> I jumped too early. Okay. It doesn't even matter which way we go from here because I don't have the charged uh, arm cannon or arm cannon upgrade. He really is vampire. That's why this version is awesome to play. You get the perks of the PlayStation and Saturn versions without all the load times. The load times really slow it down.
Nice! <laughs> thank you, thank you. It's not as nice as the others could have potentially been, but it was a much easier jump. <laughs> So Vampire, if you're just now tuning in, um, I'm basically trying to do this uh, without armor upgrades. This guy should be pretty easy. Yeah, I was telling Timu, I think my 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 struggle is going to be Sigma because I don't know how to deal with Sigma uh, without the arm cannon upgrade. I meant to ask you guys, you guys probably know, uh, Mega Man X Legacy Collection. Um, is the version of X3 on that, is that the Super Nintendo one? Or is it the, uh, the PS1 Saturn version? I'm talking X Legacy on modern systems, not the old Mega Man X Collection. It is the SNES one, okay. I need to play through that then, because... I want to play the Super Nintendo one again, but I don't want to buy another copy. Like, I sold my uh, Super Famicom copies last year. I think because the X Legacy collection was out. And I can't play them on a flash card because I don't have an SD to SNES. And I'm not going to be buying one any anytime soon. I guess we should fight Bite here. Nope, nope. Zipping through this pretty quickly, though, so that's cool.
It's sad that the game is more fun without the arm cannon upgrade. I hate having to like micromanage like what charge I'm on and like unleashing it at the right time in a certain way only to do almost the exact same amount of damage. It's just, yeah, uh, it's so cumbersome. It's counterintuitive, you know? At least in X1, with its upgraded charge, you didn't have to think about it. Whether you got a level 2 or level 3 charge, in most cases, in casual play, it didn't matter. You know? <laughs> and a level 3 charge, you were more likely to hit the enemy. Um, but this, it's like the exact opposite of that. All right, I'm gonna try the uh, the ice exploit on this guy that uh, Timu taught me earlier today. <laughs> Even the health respawns. Look at that. That's funny. <laughs> I do wish these hard tanks were a little more difficult to come by. Like, a lot- most of them are just like sitting right out in the open. I mean, in X1, like, some of them were like that. Actually, none of them were like that in X1. So, like, Storm Eagles is probably the most obvious. Well, not really the most obvious, because you don't even see it. But if you do that leap of faith, you get it. It's easy to get. Yeah, but Dillo, you have to make that mad dash to get it, you know? Otherwise, you end up dying trying to get it. Uh, and Mandrill, yeah, same thing with Mandrill. It's harder to get that. As, like, a casual player... You know, you can you can get it, but there's, there's, there's skill involved getting it in, on those stages. In this game, there is no skill. Like, it's just there. Anybody can wall jump up on this level and get that heart tank. It's just, it's a gimme, you know? But like, Mandrills is right there in the open, but you need some semblance of skill to, to, to make that jump and get it. You know, it's not a gimme. For, for, for actually a lot of players, it's not a gimme. For someone like you or I, it's different. But I know back in the day when I first played Mega Man X, I couldn't get that without, um, without the, uh, Boomer Kawanger weapon that would go and grab the heart tank for me. Oh, this is going to be interesting without the air dash. Yeah, a lot of the heart tanks in this, like Tony said, they're just here for you. And that's kind of a bummer to me. Um... Hmm. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this without... I can't... dash. I might not be able to get... I, I don't think I can get this. Like, even if I take a hit, I can't... I can't jump.
Man, that sucks. Oh well. Like in X2, I think even the heart tanks there are somewhat hidden. I remember one heart tank, I think was literally like behind a wall on one of the stages at the very beginning. <laughs> you hit that like wall jump and go through a wall. See, I need to play X2 again because I don't, you know, it's funny. I ran through it for the first time last, not first time, but first time in a long time last year. And I did multiple runs because I, I did a let's play of it on YouTube. But I honestly, I don't remember much about it anymore. But I remember liking it. I remember enjoying it a lot more now than I did like 10 years ago. You ready for this boys? <laughs> oh, I'm not as good as Timu, though. That was still fun, though. <laughs> So it's not just mash, 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 mash. You've got to time it. I was just mashing. It's still pretty cool, though. It's nice knowing uh, fun exploits like that. Yeah, so I mean, there's some, there's like a hard tank or two I'm just not going to be able to get, no matter what. Same with uh, a sub tank or two. Yeah, that's definitely something that stuck out to me about X2. The atmosphere is mostly non-existent. And I think a lot of that is actually because of the soundtrack. But I'd honestly argue kind of like the same thing with this game, too. The soundtrack... Oh, never mind. I don't even need to get on that subject. <laughs> Timu adores this game. I don't want to offend him. Um... But yeah, regarding X2, I don't rem I literally don't remember any of the music outside of the introduction stage. It's the loving kind of hate. See, this heart takes right out in the open, but at least it requires some skill to get, you know? Ow! And it takes no skill to die like that. Or maybe it takes a special kind of skill. Uh, this OST is the Saturn version OST, Tony. It's the same thing. 
It's like literally the exact same music. <laughs> he dropped the Buffy line. You know his stream's getting good when the Buffies come out. No, it's totally the same vampire. Now, if you were talking the Super Nintendo version vampire, yes, this is a different soundtrack, but it's not different than the Saturn version. It's the exact same soundtrack. Oh, this is going to be tricky without the air dash. This might even be a pain in the ass. Holy shit. God damn, man, these checkpoints. Hey, James. You get to you get to experience the Mega Man X3 you missed on YouTube. I'm doing a, another run, but this is more like a a pseudo challenge run. Where I'm not getting the uh, armor upgrades. Which really changes up how you do a lot of fights in the game. I've never done this before. But after my YouTube stream, I still have the urge to, to play it some more. I do like the game. I just don't like it anywhere near as much as the other games. So like It's one of those things where like I play this and I'm like, you know, I could be playing Mega Man X1 or Mega Man X4 or even 6 Which I do actually want to play 6 again soon. I started up a game the other night on the X collection My brother was over Yeah, I got this. It's a good thing that thing doesn't hurt you. See, I always thought it hurt you. Hmm, I'm trying to think to myself, do I like X5 more than this? Man, that's a tough one. That is a tough one. Because on one hand, X5 has decent boss fights, and it's it feels like X4 and X6. What can possibly go wrong? But then you've got all the incessant text lines and alia and quite frankly, fairly boring level design. Man, I don't know. I really don't know. Although X5 does have extreme mode. And the Sigma fight is cooler.
Yeah, that was great to know about the ice trick, too. Killing enemies with ice always gives you health back. Why are you gonna throw your computer against the wall, vampire? Yeah, screw this. I have no idea how you're supposed to deal with this without using the weakness. So far, this is the only guy in the game, well, maybe outside Sigma, where I have to use the weakness. I, I have no idea how to deal with him. First phase is fine, it's that second phase. great if there's just a way to just quick skip through this. Uh, Vampire, lower your video quality, man. Drop it down to like 720p, 30 frames a second. Could just be your computer is too slow. Or your internet connection is too slow, or both. Well, see, no, I get that part, Timu. That makes that makes sense, but I don't know how to avoid his projectiles. There's too many sparks all over the screen, you know. I really have no idea how to how to deal with it. You told it down to 720. Well, if you did that already, then lower it further, vampire. Also, what web browser are you using? Are you on your computer? You, you said you're on your computer. So you might also want to try a different web browser. You're using Chrome? Well then I would try Firefox then. Zero, my boy. Nice of you to join me. I mean, I can also lower the bitrate of my stream. <clears throat> I 
And maybe that'll make it easier for people to watch. I don't know. I feel like the bitrate doesn't even matter once you start lowering the resolution. But I'll lower it anyway. You don't need a super high bitrate for retro streaming. But I always keep it up around the 4500 range. Alright, this will be interesting. So I have to switch to zero before the Doppler 2 boss, right? Or before the mini boss room at Doppler 2. After a water section, okay. Bio has two weaknesses. Yes, I... What the... How do I get hit by that? Wow, it actually starts me right before him. Dude, what the hell, man? Hey, Miku. Welcome back. How are you doing tonight? I mean, the big thing is that I've got no armor right now, so that's, you know, my defense is very low. Dude, how do you avoid that? Uh, what's his weakness, by the way? I might be able to get this. Ray Splasher. It's that one. Okay. Oh, no! Come on! I hit select right before it hit me, and it didn't register. 
God damn it, man. I just wasted like a full sub, like all my sub tanks, actually. <sighs> damn it. All right, let me go get a refill. It's okay, that's what ice is for. I can use ice to refill. Man, I'm thinking to myself now, I wonder what Starman's music sounds like on the Game Gear Mega Man. We're gonna find out later tonight. Thanks, Miku. See, even team, uh, even Miku recognizes it, vampire. God's sake, come on. These guys are so annoying.
<laughs> he was stuck. Ah. I'm out. Um... I thought one was supposed to always give you ammo. Like, eh. Eh, whatever. <laughs> we'll see if we can get it this time. Oh, acid. Huh, but I... Hmm. Okay. I killed that one guy with acid, but it didn't give me ammo. Might be enemy specific too. Now noticing those uh, wall turret guys weren't always giving me health with ice. Sub thanks, not this guy. It's on really being on the wall doesn't count, and it's only for grounded enemies. Okay, see, that makes more sense. <laughs> Trying to find something that rhymes with ice. Nice and ice. Wait, what? Why are... Why are they giving me ammo now? What the hell, dude? I feel like it's enemy specific, Timu. An acid. It's not doing anything. I 
I came here to grind out on enemies to get health back, but... The game clearly doesn't want me to be doing that. Ice was giving me health on the previous level. Well, why is it not... Ugh! Let's try a different stage. I think it might be enemy specific. Let's see, health. Yeah, and those guys both drop health. These guys are dropping ammo. But I know they dropped health earlier. I am pretty damn sure. They just keep dropping ammo now. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure I've seen them drop health before. God, why are there so many of them, too? Hmm, I'm trying to think, is it this one that has a lot of ground turret guys here? Yeah, it is. Oh, that's cool. The ice stays on the ground. Oh, I had, uh... Yeah, it killed the guys back to back. Look at that. That's actually kind of cool. <laughs> Exploiting the, uh, the spawn. All right, that's it, actually. Actually, saving doesn't even matter because you don't get your uh, sub-tank energy back on a save. Whoa, are these guys different? Pretty sure they were, weren't they like green before? Oh, okay. Great, I get to deal with BS enemy spawning. Jeez. Maybe a little bit harder, too? Alright, this just turned into Mega Man X hard type.
Man, that was a pain. Uh, there's water here. <laughs> yeah, this is different. I mean, that's cool. Oh, it's not gonna let me go back. My mech is still down there. Oh, it's still not gonna let me. Yeah, I figured this is the water section you were talking about. This is totally different. Well, that actually makes these jumps easier. Now I kind of understand why that floor design is there. So it's this one right here. Uh, how do I switch to zero, by the way? Ah, oh, there it is. Okay. X, I'm on my way. Sweet. And I guess I can use sub tanks with him. Okay, so first try basically. Is this the guy? Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Zero can't use sub tanks? What the fucking hell, man? Zero, why do you suck so much? It's a good thing I can just close out and reload. I wonder if it's going to make me do all the Doppler stages again. Hey, Seminosuke, how are you doing tonight? I mean, even if it does, it's not a big deal. It's not like the Doppler stages are that long. Yeah, see, I wouldn't have been that lazy had I known that Zero couldn't use sub-tanks. 
It's like the energy is still there. Why can't he use it? It's it's kind of dumb. <laughs> it's not kind of dumb. It's really fucking dumb. Like, dude, what the hell? Yeah, we got to do the whole thing over again. Okay, so saving after the Doppler stages doesn't even do anything. There's no point in, in saving. That's fine. At least we know. Yeah, that's what Timu said, Vampire. He goes down with one buster shot and one saber. By the way, how's your stream been working, Vampire? Is it stable now? There aren't supposed to be two of them there. All right, let's. Okay, never mind. I can't get back up. They're still doing it, but not as long. Are you still watching the 720p or did you lower to like 480p? I did lower the stream bitrate. It's at 3,500 now instead of 4,500. I mean, 480p might not even make a big difference because this is, you know, such a low resolution game. Oh, you lowered it to 480? Wow. Oh, uh, I would go to speedtest.net and see what your connection speeds are at right now, because it could be your connection. But sometimes if your computer sucks, it's that too. And I would highly recommend installing a second web browser, like Firefox, for situations like these. Yes, yeah, so we're right back here. It didn't take that long. Because sometimes the browsers are also just suck.
All right, what the hell is the point of frog? Fuck me. We might have to do it again. <laughs> Wait, what? Um. Well, I guess I can just die. No, no, he's having a problem watching my stream, Samurusuke. He's not streaming. Yeah, your upload doesn't do anything, Vampire, when you're just watching. What's your download at? I mean, if your upload's at 22, your download should be perfectly fine, to be honest. Yeah, your your connection is perfectly fine, dude. <laughs> what is the point of that mech? Yeah, dude, try a different browser. All right, let's try this again. The frog armor can swim. How does it swim? How do you get that to work? Yeah, what what are your computer specs, vampire? Yeah, you need to check that stuff. How much crap they have running in the background unnecessarily. Alright, Timu, I, I'm gonna give up, man. I don't really care about this that much. Wait, no. Fuck it. I need that Z-Saber, though. God damn it. Alright, last try. My problem is I was chatting. I wasn't paying attention. I just ran right into that guy. Where are you going, Patchouli? Yeah, I mean, you need to make sure you're not running a bunch of crap in the background, too, that eats up all your memory. Uh, Nis, I don't need tips, man. The only reason I died is I wasn't fucking paying attention. I literally just ran right into him because I was looking at fucking chat.
Like, it was my mistake. Just like... Just like when I ran into that boss room as X. Like, I didn't mean to do that. I wasn't fucking looking. And sometimes, sometimes I, that blur. Sometimes that happens when you're streaming. You're too focused on other things. It doesn't help that I'm on, like, my third or fourth beer right now, either. Wow, is that it already? That was fast. Uh, yeah, Vampire, you should be fine. You gotta make sure you don't gotta have, like, a lot of bloat installed on your computer. Your, uh... Your Twitch should be perfectly fine at those specs. You should have zero issues. So definitely try Firefox. Let me know how that works. This is Mega Man X 37 and a half. The greatest game ever made. Hey, baby. Would you like to know how much RAM I have? I'd tell you how much RAM I have, but, um... It really doesn't fucking matter, because it's gonna eventually be obsolete. Like, the 256 whopping megabytes I have in my... My Windows 98 machine here. Actually, it's... It's 512 megabytes. Ooh. <laughs> Killer specs, dude. Um, I personally liked Mega Man X27, uh, Timu. Shame it took them that many tries to get the series right. But you know, at least they had one good game. <laughs> Duff McWhalen. <laughs> I wonder if it's still Duff in the, uh, Windows 95 version. I'm guessing it is. Holy fuck. Suck it. Yeah, no, I was just wondering, Semenosuke, because uh, I wanted to get X5 on PC so I can do a couple streams of it here. Alright, let's not screw this up again.
blah 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 Yeah, everyone says X20 was terrible. I don't blame them. Oh, I see. You press the dash button. I learned to like X6. I mean, I tell people X6 is an acquired taste. You know, it kind of requires a certain mindset and requires a certain understanding. Ah! Damn you, frog. You're useless. Useless, I tell you. All right, not looking at chat. What? Suck it! And uh, you couldn't give him your bean saver elsewhere. Um. Huh. Interesting. Okay, that is actually pretty cool. I will give it that. I was expecting the Z Saber to be longer. X, you get the uh, the reject version of my sword. Oh, come on. Exploits for the win. <laughs> Whoa! What? That was super weird. Some janky screen scroll. All right. Well, this will be interesting without the uh, air dash.
<laughs> Even Nist thinks the Super Buster Charge was horrible. We were talking about that earlier on the YouTube stream. Actually, I think we were talking about it on this stream, too. It's that bad. We have to talk about it multiple times. What makes you think that, Vampire? Your speed settings are fine. You did speed test. Is anyone else out there having problems with Twitch? Oh, this is new. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh look at that damage! Holy shit! Yeah, yeah, I agree, Nist. I still think that was pretty awesome. Okay, maybe... S You're on Firefox now? I mean, maybe it's just your computer or shit, Vampire. Like, I don't know what pro programs you're running in the background and whatnot. What about watching on your phone or some other device? You have multiple devices, right? Yeah, see, I like the Buster upgrade in X1. Whoo! Look at that damage. That's actually pretty amazing. You know, that makes the boss rush a lot more palatable. Yeah, I uh, never really knew about the dashing shot thing in X1 until recently. So I don't actually do it that much. I mean, I've started trying to incorporate it into my game, but it's not something I ever knew about back then. Yeah, Z Saber is pretty nice. I like it. <laughs> I do. I like it quite a bit. I also like how it sounds like a lightsaber.
<laughs> Why not a hurricane kick? You know, missed opportunity. All right, flat, how about a flash kick? Seriously though, the hurricane kick would have made the most sense because hurricane kick, Shoryuken, and Hadoken. Those are the three signature moves for Ryu and Ken. I hate that guy. Oh, Raging Demon. That would be badass. That actually would be pretty pretty badass. I'd be okay with that. Because that move takes some more skill to, to pull off, too. Oh, that's good. The fish has been filleted. I also like that you don't have to be at full health to use the Z-Saber. My name's Doppler. I'm a douchebag. If my attitude didn't tell you I was douchey, my hair would. I feel like God now. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, well this is it. Let's uh, go get a refill. I'm gonna go use the bathroom too. I'll be right back.
<laughs> the arranged music makes him upset. <laughs> Now I want to play the Super Nintendo one. I want to go through there. Thanks, Miku. That's one way to do it. Photon, it is on PC, yeah. This is the uh, Windows 95 version from 1998. Okay. <laughs> yeah, now comes the hard part. Yep. I hate this part, man. Like, if you can get past those jumps, it's actually pretty easy. But if you don't get past those jumps, ah, oh, it's aggravating as all hell. How are you going to do this without zero busting through now?
Oh, look at this! Dude, wireframes! Wireframes! <laughs> well, actually, X2 did have uh, onboard ships. X2 and X3 both had it. That's why uh, they had chips just for doing the wireframes. Elevator music to end things. Why must humans fight against reploids? And why must reploids fight against each other? Oh, 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 oh. As X stares at the burring. Burring? What the fuck is burring? Remnants. <laughs> I can't do this. <laughs> It's fucking music, man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, you know, burring. <laughs> Uh, Summon of Suke, they use it on the X3 title screen, too, actually. It's a little more subtle, though. Thanks, Timu. Now we're gonna fire up some Mega Man on the Game Gear. You're right, Summon of Suke. It would've been a thousand times better. Oh, look, this is different. No, it's not different. Zero, what are you doing there? Is that the problem with using FMV? Oh shit! I didn't mean to. Fuck. God damn it. I hit escape by accident. Sorry, guys. Yeah, you can see some other full motion video that looks like crap. I'm gonna adjust my mic. 